hello guys so this is the galaxy m12 and in this video i'll show you how to root this one okay this is using the exynos 850 on android 12 and it's on one ui core 5y1 on binary 4 okay so make sure to follow all the steps so you will not get any trouble okay all the file and step i'll provide in my blog you can check the link in the description box okay if you have any questions feel free to ask on the comment sections so stay tuned and check it out okay hello guys i'm gonna meet again with ombop okay this time i have the galaxy m12 and today we're going to try to read it okay galaxy m12 it's using Exynos 8850. Uh, the code name is M S M M127F. Yeah, it's using Android 13. And <clears throat> it's using 64 bit clock is between 500 and 2 gigahertz. Yeah. So first thing to do is go to the settings and let's check the setting system <clears throat> you can see right here it's using one ui core y5.1 with routine and you must pay attention to the build number okay this the build number is binary 4 you can see right here m127 fxxu4 okay 4 is the binary first thing to do enable the developer option hit the build number five times and go back go back again <clears throat> go to the developer option and make sure to turn on the lm unlock okay so we must turn it on so we can unlock the bootloader okay okay make sure you have the same firmware like i do or otherwise you have the firmware that you're using on your pawn next step we need to have the stock firmware so i already download the file and extract to here okay extract all the folder i also extract all the file put it in the folder and we'll see the apbl and other stuff just open the ap find the boot image extract boot image and also the vb meta so we have to file now let's copy the pad right here and paste it and select the two file you want to compress the two file get the archive selector and hit ok <clears throat> okay like usual where do you can find the firmware okay simply go to the same fv.com slash firmware slash blah 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 uh, find your region right here i'm in indonesian so i'm using indonesian region and download the firmware that same as your phone okay this is my firmware and i already downloaded it okay <clears throat> next we need to copy the two files <clears throat> first thing uh let's copy the tar image Put it into the folder. I put it in the, the document folder. <clears throat> and we also need magis. 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 So feel free to use magis you like. I'm using the delta canary and paste it. Okay. Now switch back to the pond. <clears throat> Next, let's find the file manager. Okay, my file go to the internal storage <clears throat> go to the folder where you copy the file and put it into the main folder let's install the delta canary and if it asks for permission just give it permission okay and when it finishes we can open the <clears throat> ranges so we can apply the patch okay now hit install select and patch file 
and find where you have your tar emits. Okay, this is my tar emits. Let's go. It will start uncompressing, patching the file, and also compress the file again. And it will put the file on the download folder. Okay, let's switch again. And now let's navigate to internal storage again. Go to the download folder. And this is my patch. Put it in, in here. Okay, done. Now all we need to do is just unlock put all the pawn okay now let's turn off the pawn because we want to unlock put loader the pawn okay then next prepare your usb cable and you can do the unlock put loader by pressing the volume up and volume down at the same time and then plug usb cable until it's shown a blue screen on the pawn okay let's try it Okay, now you will see a warning sign. <clears throat> and next, press the film up. Long press the film up, about five seconds, until it's shown you the another confirmation like this. Okay, unlock the other. Yes, just press the film up once, and it will start start unlock the bootloader. Okay. After it's unlocking, it will automatically restart. <clears throat> Go to the stock recovery and start formatting the internal storage. So make sure to back up all the files. Okay, okay let's wait. Okay, erasing the internal storage. When it finish, let's press the film up and film down again. So we can go to the download mode again. Okay. Now we just press volume up once. And we're good to go. So in here I already opened the Odin. Okay, I'm using the version 3.14. Okay. Go to the option tab. Make sure uncheck the auto reboot. Copy the path where you have copied the edges path. Okay, and then hit the AP button. Paste the pad and select the magic pads. Okay, now it start. It will start flashing. And when it finishes, it's become green. Okay, after this, we need to force reboot the pawn into the stock ROM to wipe the data one more time. Okay, now let's unplug the USB cable. And we need to force reboot the pawn. Okay, force reboot can be done by press the flow down and power button at the same time hold the two button about five seconds until the pawn reboot and when the pawn reboot quickly switch to the flow up while still pressing the flow down okay you must wait until it goes to the stock recovery like i said mm, several video maybe you fail for first time you can try it again just make sure it doesn't boot into the Android first, okay. And here we go, now we are in the stock recovery. You can navigate using volume up, volume down, and hit OK with the power button, okay. Now, scroll down, select wipe cache partition, okay, yes, and then wipe data. Scroll down, factory set, okay, you're good to go. Now reboot system. Okay, now we are on the home screen. So now let's open the file manager. Okay, so I already copied the magic APK right here. Go to the install storage and install the apps. Okay. And like usual, I said, don't forget to connect to the internet using Wi Fi or SIM card before you reboot the magic apps. Okay. Otherwise, your pawn will get boot loop because the OM unlock has not been turned on. Okay. Now let's open the mages. Okay. I will set to you two times. <laughs> Make sure connect to the internet before 
restart the magic okay as usual require additional setup it's okay and the pawn will automatically restart in five seconds and here we go now we are in the home screen again so i've installed several apps okay the dev check <clears throat> advanced root checker root beer and safety net okay let's open the mages okay, so right here we have successfully installed mages okay from here you can play around sauce body pasture elbows and other stuff okay and let's open the root checker your M12 is rooted on Android T. Nice. Now let's open root beer. <clears throat> so root beer also said that our bond is rooted. Okay. Safety net. Safety net will set the response signature validation fail because we have rooted. Okay, you can always fix the safety net. The uh, root detection by installing module in here okay you can install a safety net fix and also enable the zygis and magis hide from here to hide from the root checker and root beer and other apps okay that's all guys i i hope it helps you if you find it helpful please give it a thumb okay so See you in the next video. Wassalamualaikum.